everybody. So we are here at the Devil's Isle, and Andrea and I are actually just grabbing a quick little breakfast this morning. You know the deal. We're gonna jump right into it, do a quick little food review, and see what they got. Already sweet, okay. Mm -hmm. So I don't need this. What did you end up ordering? I got the London fog. I guess the um, syrup is on the bottom, maybe? It comes with vanilla syrup. I sort of want to dip this in it. Is that weird? Ooh. It's like a cookie. Mm. It's like an almond cookie. Ooh. It's quite good. So right here I have the iced hibiscus herbal tea. It tastes nice. It has like a little spicy kick to it. It's really good. Andrea, what happened to your drink? I drank it all. You drank I gotta it all. drink it before it gets cold. Thank you. <laughs> what would you end up ordering? Coke Madame. Ooh. They make it with a croissant, so that's good. <laughs> I love that. I just ended up ordering the breakfast burrito, so I kept it really simple and also ordered just one single pancake. Thinking about maybe getting a side of fruit, but we'll see. I think I'm probably gonna be full by the end of that. Food's looking really good. Presentation's awesome. I love the cutlery and the plates that they use. Everything looks nice and rustic. So a little bit of a different switch away from like the typical Bermuda Island stuff, but I think it's nice. I ate my first half of the breakfast burrito. We'll all take a second to check that out. So what this is made up of is got a little bit of egg, you got your American cheese, got some avocado, lettuce, tomatoes, black beans, onions, maybe a little bit of secret sauce as well. But I've actually had this before. I love getting it whenever I come here. It's absolutely delicious. It's nice and mild. Even the secret sauce is really smooth. It's good. A 10 out of 10 for sure. I've been trying to watch my figure lately, eat a little bit less in terms of calories, but Andrea talked me into ordering one pancake, so I went ahead, got it. Let's do our first pour of syrup. This pancake has Nutella drizzle on it, some strawberries, and a little bit of sugar. It's nice and soft. Biting into it, it's kind of like biting into a pillow. This is, this is definitely a dessert. It doesn't scream pancake at all. It's just super, super sweet. A really nice finish to the breakfast. So I'm definitely happy that I ordered it. Waiter actually just walked over and offered Andrea and I some free drinks. I specifically ordered the French vanilla frappuccino with oat milk, and I forget what Andrea ordered, but she can tell you. Pistachio chai. So we're gonna try those out really quick, and then we're gonna bounce. But we're actually gonna come back a little bit later and do a second actual food review. The manager gave me the approval to come in here, get some shots at the restaurant, and you know, just do a proper food review. Ooh, that's so good. So I got the pistachio chai. 
it's really nice. Um, it's like the perfect amount of sweetness, not too sweet, and it's very mild, so if you're not much of a coffee person and you prefer tea, um, it's a good one to get. This is the French vanilla frappuccino. I got it with oat milk because of my milk intolerance, but it's delicious. So. I didn't tell the difference between something like this and Starbucks. They taste the exact same. So for those of you who are coming over from overseas, this will be right in your wheelhouse and something that will be very familiar. Good morning, everybody. So we are back at the Devil's Isle, like I promised. And we are actually going to be doing a little bit of a brunch this time. The last time you all saw us eat a little bit of breakfast, which was a lot of fun. We got to eat a bunch of sweet, sweet stuff. So today, thank you so much. Today, we're more in the mood of mixing it up. Andrea and I actually just ordered our drinks. I ended up getting the caramel frappuccino. Ice chai latte. Yeah, she got the ice chai latte. This thing hopefully is as good as the one that I tried last time. Last time I got the French vanilla, so this time I got the caramel. Let's see what it tastes like. Honestly, they taste about the same. They taste very similar. It's a slight difference in flavor, but the consistency is really, really good. The ice is nice and chopped up. It's really nice. Andrea, how does yours taste? How is it? It's quite good. It's pretty good. Not too sweet, which I like. Also, these seats are very it's unfortunate because every time I come here, I always want to just get the breakfast burrito because it's really, really tasty. But I think this time I'm probably going to go with the huevos rancheros just because it's still giving me a lot of the things that the breakfast burrito is, but um, just in a little bit different form because you got the tortilla chips. Also, I think maybe I'm thinking about getting crepes as well. Um, or just switching it up and getting maybe like one piece of French toast and one pancake. Because the pancake was really, really good last time. Ended up getting it with strawberries. It was super tasty. So what are you thinking about getting? Um, I'm looking at this grilled harissa chicken sandwich. Ooh, it looks good. That does look good. Grilled chicken sandwich. Did I get it? Fried? 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 Okay, that's fine. I get the huevos rancheros. Yeah. And then could I also get it without sour cream, please? And could I get the crepes as well? I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try the huevos rancheros first and see how that tastes. I'm a big, big, big fan of Mexican food, so of course I had to order something that really somewhat resembles it. This actually looks like it has a really, really nice tomato sauce for a base. They give you some really delicious, scrumptious chips and some guac and cheese. Oh my god. Mm. That's crazy good. What's in it? Mm. So we have the egg and got tomatoes. So nice little round cherry tomatoes. And then I believe cilantro, onions. I'm not quite sure what type of cheese that is though. What type, what type of cheese do you think that is, Andre? Parmesan. Parmesan? Yeah. And then some crunchy corn chips. Mm. Wow. Sauces on it are quite mild. I think it's like a chili sauce and then olive. The um, portobello mushroom is really nice and the bread too. I'm super excited for this. Got the crepes right here. Gotta check them out, see what they taste like. And there's cinnamon on top of it. Please try this. I don't know if I like the pancake better or the crepe better. 
video I hope that you enjoyed it we tried a bunch of different foods came back here a couple times if you're ever in Bermuda if you're ever traveling if you live in Bermuda and you just want to stop by and have a quick little breakfast definitely recommend Devil's Isle it is it is a really really special place and also it's not too expensive please don't forget to like comment and subscribe thank you once again and I will catch you in the next one